So recently Taco Bell dropped a new item and I'm not that impressed. And that is their double berry mixed freeze, double berry freeze, that's what it's called, whatever. Now I've had one of their, their freeze drinks and they're, they're fine. The red one, pretty good. The blue one, good. So mix it together, logically would be fine. But generally I like when Taco Bell pairs their drinks with a new food item. I think it pairs where I want instead of just having a lone release, works way better. But it's a, uh, it's a slow, slow uh, food drop uh, for early January. So, also because I've never actually talked about this. So how is it? Let's find out. I, yeah, I've already heard some things thanks to uh, Marcus Frieza and so then saying I got a couple of people about this. So I very have very, very low expectations. I immediately think like Trix yogurt or like um, Crunch Berries from Captain Crunch. Like it's not bad, but again, talk about, I think you should drop your drink releases with another food item, pair it very well with like, oh, there's a new drink. It's a pair well for something that's like, like a something spicy, like when they did the, the Frito burrito thing, well, burrito, whatever it was called, you had that. Pair it with something like this, something spicy, something cool. Like, do something like that. I think that's way better. I don't like it when these places do like um, lone drink releases and not food on releases. Like, it's it's really strange. Other places do have that idea. Like, Chick fil A all in Sonic always drop a shake, a new shake with one of their food items. Which, hats off to you. Uh, Starbucks and Dunkin' also, when they drop their winter menu, you have your coffees and you have your other little snacks. Check out my Dunkin' Donut. Uh, ice macchiato video popping up here. It, that works way better. Here it doesn't. It's not bad. This is a good summer drink. I don't think it needed to drop now though. Um, didn't they have some like weird press thing that Taco Bell did? Like they were like announcing some stuff for the future and this is where this came from. Like it's it's really weird. But it's not bad. I gotta give this a five out of 10 overall. It's not bad, but it could be better. What are your guys' thoughts? Let me know in the comments. Do you like it, hit it, dislike it, let me know. While you're also down there, uh, like the video and subscribe to the channel. You can find me on most social media platforms at, at uh, FT underscore Fantastic Food Reviews on most social media platforms. I'm also on Blue Sky now, so links are all down below along with my podcast, Logging the Pizza Party uh, Podcast, again on most social media platforms at Pizza Party Pod. Guys, have an amazing rest of your day. Stay very safe, people. Peace.